The US versus China, who will rule the future of tech? Hello folks, thank you for joining us in this analysis. Team Bawo is proud having you on board the US versus China in a full-on tech showdown. Next level competition for global dominance. 5G, AI, quantum computing, building blocks of the future. China leads in 37 out of 44 critical technologies, but the US has serious strengths. Top-tier universities, a culture of innovation, and capital. Let's break down a 10-part strategy for the US to reclaim its tech throne. First things first, we gotta light a fire under American innovation. We're talking a massive boost to R&D spending, like quadrupling it. That means pouring resources into game-changing fields like AI, quantum computing, next-gen semiconductors, you name it. But it's not just about research, it's about bringing manufacturing back to the US. Think massive tax breaks to incentivize companies like Intel and Tesla to build cutting-edge factories right here on American soil. Just like the space race, this kind of focused effort could lead to breakthroughs we haven't even dreamed of. Let's talk about supply chains. China controls critical minerals like lithium and cobalt, essential for electronics. The US needs to break that grip. Streamline permits, forge alliances with Australia and Canada, and diversify sources. Build a silicon shield with Taiwan, South Korea, and Japan for crucial chips. Get serious about export controls to slow China's progress. None of this matters without the best minds. China knows this, aggressively recruiting top talent globally. The US needs to step up, streamline visas and green cards for STEM experts. Also cultivate talent at home, invest in STEM education from kindergarten to grad school. Let's talk green tech. China dominates solar panels and EV batteries. The US needs massive gigafactories, plus a nationwide network of EV charging stations. Tariffs on Chinese products could help level the field. Pair tariffs with subsidies for American clean energy innovation. AI and quantum computing. These technologies will define the next era. China is racking up patents at an alarming rate. The US needs to fight fire with fire. Imagine a national AI lab for groundbreaking research. We need to push the boundaries of what's possible. Prevent American cloud services from training Chinese AI. Invest in achieving quantum supremacy. China's strides in quantum tech mean we can't fall behind. Let's be real, China's tech ambitions aren't just about economic dominance, they're about spreading their influence and their model of digital authoritarianism. Think about the reach of apps like TikTok and WeChat, they're powerful tools for surveillance and censorship. The US needs to counter this by promoting democratic alternatives. We're talking about supporting companies like Meta and X, formerly Twitter, that are committed to free expression and privacy. We need to make it clear that technology should be used to empower people, not control them. The United States leads in defense technology. To maintain that edge, we must innovate, invest in dual-use technologies like drones and hypersonic aircraft. The Pentagon's Defense Innovation Unit connects with startups. We must secure our supply chains. As China eyes space, we must accelerate our space program through NASA and private companies like SpaceX. Cyber attacks and intellectual property theft are constant threats in today's interconnected world. China has been particularly aggressive in both areas. To protect our critical infrastructure, the US needs mandatory cybersecurity standards, ensuring these systems are resilient and can withstand sophisticated attacks. Imagine a cyber national guard to respond to major cyber incidents. Money talks, and the US has a powerful tool at its disposal, its financial markets. We need to be strategic about where we allow investments to flow. Blocking investments in Chinese tech companies tied to the military or human rights abuses is crucial. We must double down on American innovation to create the next tech giants. The US can't win this tech race alone. We need a coalition of democracies sharing our values and commitment to innovation. Think of it as a tech NATO, a united front against China's tech bullying. This coalition could share R&D resources and coordinate on export controls. We could offer 5G loans and development assistance. Together we can set the global standard for ethical tech. So, there you have it, a 10-part strategy for how the US can reclaim its tech supremacy. Look, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. This is going to be a long and challenging road. 
But the stakes have never been higher. This isn't just about who has the coolest gadgets. It's about who shapes the future of technology. The U.S. has world-class universities, a vibrant entrepreneurial spirit, and a deep pool of capital. But it's going to take focused effort and smart investments to out-innovate China. What do you guys think? Can the U.S. pull it off? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Peace.